Hey, it's him. Are you murder? Oh, you are. You're murder McTurda. Murder McTurda's a gambling man. Yo, what's going on guys? It's me, Morvi, and I'm back again with another playthrough. Today, we've got a new job as a prison warden in Prison Simulator Prologue. Now, this is one of the newer titles on Steam, and it is free to play. So if you do like the gameplay you're seeing today, you can play it yourself. Uh, I'll put a link in the description down below where you can download it. Uh, so yeah, so from what I understand, this game has us playing as a prison warden on our first day, and we get to learn the ropes. Uh, making sure all the prisoners are kept safe and making sure there's no fights happening uh, and just making sure the day-to-day -day goes smoothly but i do believe there is a respect part of this game so you have to gain the respect of the prison wardens and or the prisoners so you can be corrupt as hell or you can be by the book and mr bootlicker i think we're gonna be running around this prison uh doing our day-to-day -day tasks and i think we get to pick up quests along the way from different people we meet so it'll be interesting to see what we get given. Now, I'm not too sure if I'm going to be corrupt as hell yet or if I'm going to be Mr. Goody Two Shoes. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, before we start, guys, if you like this video, please hit that like button. And if you want to see more, hit that subscribe button. I've just hit 500 subscribers and I'm so happy. Thank you to everyone who's done it. Uh, you mean the world to me. If you want to see me play games live, then please go to my Twitch channel. It is twitch.com forward slash Mr. Movie and go over there and give me a follow. I am super looking forward to playing this one as some of the other simulators that have come out in the past. My PC was dead. So now having a working PC, I get to play them. I'm not going to lie, I wouldn't mind being a prisoner, but a prison warden. We'll do it. We need a job. We need to get some money. And I guess if we're corrupt, we might get put in the cells ourselves. So yeah, let's jump into prison simulator. Okay, first things first. Let's get the cans on so we can hear what we are doing. Right. Officer, what do we get for officer? We have less health for the prisoners, NPCs. Does that mean prison guards? Oh, do we get to like go to visitation? Oh, ooh. <laughs> ammo. Okay, I did see in the trailer there is, it looks like there can be quite a bit of shooting. Uh, we're going to do sergeant today. Uh, we're going to go straight down the middle. Sorry. What was that? Welcome to the Prisoner Creator. Here you can choose the appearance of your convicts. Sorry? On the right, there are options to customize your prisoner's first and last name and change their voice. Also on the right, you can customize the prisoner's body, face, and the skin tone. When the prisoner is ready, press confirm. If you don't want to choose how your prisoner looks, press random and then confirm. So I've got to customize 16 people. I'm the warden. Why am I customizing the prisoners? Oh, sexy. Who we got? Oh, so this guy is... He's in for murder, apparently. Okay. He's named Walter. No, your name is Muk Murder. Muk Turda. Oh, no. Turda. There we go. That shows how old I am. Right, Muk Murder, Muk Turda, dude. You don't look... Yeah, you, yeah, okay. You can have a face tattoo because you're you're hard. You're hard as nails. Wait, can't we have? Can't we have the old man with a face tattoo? Oh, we can't. Is that the only face tattoo man's we have? Oh no. We got this geezer. Oh, nice. Oh, we got a, a complete custom one. Cute. Oh, yeah, you're... Okay, yeah, you're Murder McTurda. Robbery. Steely Muk no feely Because he has no feelings when he steals from people. Obviously. All right, lock. Murder. All right, we got Murder McTurda. And Steve. <laughs> oh, these are great. All right. Um, okay, so he's harmless. But he's in for murder. So... No harmy. No alarmy. Awesome. You know what? I can't go through 16. I can't deal with 16 like this. If I'm quite honest. Murder. Deffy. Very stressy. All right, cool. Right, lock him in. 
And then we'll randomize a lot of them. That'll do. I can't go for all 16. We'll be here all day. Gang creator. That's what we got so far. We've got the squirrels, the foxes, and the bears. No. No. Um. I love Hamilton. I can't put kisses. Damn it. Okay, so okay, they can't be called the soft fire kisses. Uh, what can we call them? Let's have a think. I've got it. Got it. The tiny testicles. And then... Ooh, what should we got? I love Hamilton. The tiny testicles. And I guess... I guess we'll throw in... Well, let's throw in MS-13. Just, just for the sheer, sheer bants of it. Right, let's randomize them all. Okay, I love Hamilton. Yeah. That stick it to the man. This is great already. And MS-13, they can have they can have a little deer. They can have a deer. Some of your decisions may increase or decrease the prisoner's respect for you. For example, if you let the prisoners stay in the cells or force them to go to assembly. Oh god, have I got to literally like escort them everywhere? What have I got myself into? Your main task is to carry out routines assigned to you for the day. Check the list in the journal, default J. Okie dokie. During the day, react to the prisoner's bad behavior either by talking to them or using F. Most of your actions can be evaluated by other guards and prisoners, which affects your level, le uh, level of respect. Your overall level of respect, bottom left corner of the screen, is the average of your individual relationships with prisoners. During your free time, you can relax by playing mini games or doing side quests. More of these activities will be available in the future. Oh, pick up fire extinguisher. Oh, hell yeah. Sup, boy? Ah, first day on the job. Oh, okay. So we got Q is an inventory and we have our fists, a clicker, which I've got now. Nice. A nightstick. Oh, wait, are these numbered? Oh, okay. Uh, we got walkie talkie, pepper spray, and taser. I like how they've given us both. Like, wouldn't don't they do the same thing? We've got riot gun. Ah, they win the fort. Okay, so you don't start with a machine gun, sadly. That's fine. Uh, let's get my fists out for the time being. Everything's fine here. Reported for duty! Relax. Call me Richard. We're on duty, but we don't stick to, yes, sir that much oh how nice how are you holding up feeling the pressure of your first day no i am pumped great there's nothing to be afraid of it's a peaceful job for the most part really by the way on the first day of work everyone has a meeting with the warden and he expects the same from you do you know where the office is yeah <laughs> just between the two of us something's going on in this prison i don't know exactly what but watch yourself okay enough of that come Follow me. Okay, so he's conspiracy theorist. Do we pick up this? Nope. Are we... Oh, we're dressed. We've got our Doc Martens on. Oh, we're in a prison. We're here. Where'd he go? What did he say? Don't you have anything to do? No, mate. It's my first day. Zzz. Not sleeping anymore. I mean, I'm vigilant. Don't be sleeping, buddy. You're my backup. Oh, hi there, sir. Can I take a seat? Nope. <laughs> nope. New guy, how good to see you. How do you like it here? Eh. Where's the toilet? If you've got a sense of humor, you'll find it. You're a big boy. He's chatting me up. He loves me. Next, keep your eyes on the boys in the yard. Block B can really stir up some shit, so be careful. In the afternoon, a new delivery of items from prisoners' relatives arrives. Inspect them. You can't even imagine what their wives try to smuggle. Oh, I bet, son. Harry bows. Take a break, drink some coffee, and work out with the guys at the gym or something. We've got a gym. There's perks in this job. How much do I get paid? What's my hourly? I almost forgot. Go to the guys in the guards' room in the afternoon. They'll instruct you on some skills. Ah, oh, task complete. We've got some cool music. What if these were like real mugshots? They just took off Google. <laughs> that they got arrested and come out and they start playing a game like, hold up, that's me. 
Okay, so what are we doing? Go to the search room. I want to... Is there no time? Is, oh, it, okay, there's no time. So technically, I can just, like, walk around. Right, I hope. So we've got an infirmary. Oh, you can buy some food if you need. Eating resources restores your HP. Pick up what you have left MB to set quantity and confirm. So do I have money? Oh, I do have money. I got, a, I got, what does it mean? What does it mean legal, legal? I don't know what you mean. Uh, I don't, I don't, hey, you can't be leaving keys like that. That's a safety hazard. Okay, so this is the shoot, the shooting range. Holy, what? How advanced is this prison? Okay. Small army. Emergency box. What's that? Pistol. Can I break it? Yeah. No. Okay. Well, I do have a gun though, right? Instead of doing my job, I'm going to the high-tech shooting range. Oh, God. Um, this is to fight prisoners. Hey, prisoner, get back to your cell. Ah! No dilly-dallying. Right, okay. Back to work. We've got to go to the search room and search some prisoners. I'm late. I'm late. Go. Ah! Okay, there's a lot. There's a lot to do in this. Oh, we got some pop-ups, so that's fine. Um, yeah, so we've got to call them in with this. New prisoner, please. Thank you. Who we got? We got Ricky Podolsky. Good morning, screw. He's in for a horrible crime, but he's harmless. So can I just beat him now? Can I just, can I just have him out? Right, boys, turn the cameras off. We're going in. We're, stick we're sticking to the job so far. The prisoners are 22% respectful of me so far. Um, okay, so we open his folder. Ricky Podolsky. Yep. Oh, here you go. He tells us here. Prepare the data. Check the compliance of fingerprints with control sheet fingerprints. Check the correctness of the name data on the fingerprint sheets. Check if the ID number is correct on the fingerprint sheet. Okie dokie. So we've got Ricky Podolsky. Ricky Podolsky. Ricky Podolsky. Ricky Podolsky. Okay, I got his name right at least. Bless him. Not bless him actually. No, fuck him. 360405. 360405. Yeah. He's in block A. Now let's stick him in the execute. Let's just execute him. It's easier. Bro, I want to zap you so bad. I'm going to catch you on the yard. Pick up the list by pressing E. Okay, list. So we've got deodorant. This is his deodorant can. And it is new mild. 48 hour protection. So what can we do? Take it, rotate it, open it. Let's open it. Ricky, mate, what's this? What's this weird shadow? Have you hidden something in there, Ricky? If you search on the list, press E to get off the list. But I suspected it. Hold up. Press F to search him. Okay. Oh, it's Resident Evil. Take the supply. Take supplies for a prisoner by pressing E. Give the prisoner his supplies. Ah. There we go, Ricky. Uh, call the guards. Come get this sack of... Oh, call another prisoner. Let's go. So you're that, that guy from Prison Break. You want to get it in the snout? Um, no, I don't, John. Really? Right, name's John. John there. John there. You. What did you do? Oh, did you? Oh. Okay, you're in block C though. Um, eight four two seven one zero. Eight four two seven one zero. Yep. He's American. That doesn't really mean anything. Cool. Yep. I'm not sure if there's anything I can find wrong on this. Oh, I can reject him. I don't know why. I'll... Oh, wait. He's in from... Oh, he's in from... Uh, that. Okay. Um, right, dickhead. Where's your glasses? Oh, here they are. 
Right. Yep, they are definitely glasses. Okay, we put that down. Then we're going to search you. Oh, we found... What did we find? Spicy dried beef. Secure means that you confiscate the item and... Oh, and officially report it to the prison. Take means you secretly take it and keep it for yourself. Leave. Okay. So I can... Oh, it's legal. Now, you know what? Screw you, bro. I'm taking that. It's mine. <laughs> Give the prisoner supplies. I'm going to eat your beef while you go snuggle in to your new cell, my friend. Call the god of the microphone. Oh, we've done it. Free time. It's now your free time. You play some mini games and side quests. When you notice that someone has an exclamation point above their head, it means he has a quest for you. Okay, so what do we do first? In our free time, we can... What is that? Is that parkour? Oh no, that's a bench. So we've got aiming, shooting, aiming, weights. Is that it? So what's the, dif what's the difference between these two shooties? This one's closer. So let's go to this. Hey, bud. Can I talk to you? Oh, can I talk to you? Oi, stop whistling. I want to talk to you. Bro, don't make me. Okay, so I've done this. This is the shooting range. What's this? Weapon cleaning. There, there's, there is a lot more to do in this game than I first thought. <laughs> Who's cleaning an AK-47 in a prison? What prison is this? So we're going to clean the AK-47. We'll remove that. We'll remove that. Hey, I did it. Cool. That's clean. Let's give you a little spray. Make you look pretty. Then we'll flip you. Oh, yeah, we're getting somewhere. I need to be looking after prisoners, but I'm doing this instead. Oh, I think you just got to find the splotches. Okay, we're done. We did it. Nice. So now let's put this back together. Then that bad boy, then that bad boy, then that bad boy. And we've got a machine gun again. So we're done. We got it. Nice. I got respect. Did I get respect for that? No. Just clean someone's gun for no reason. Okay. Hey, buddy. Do you wanna, can you talk to me? Are we friends? Nope. You're just going to yawn in my face and walk off. Okay. That's fine. Let's go to the prison yard, I guess. Well, nothing's happened so far. No one wants to talk to me. No one wants to... Do you want to talk to me? Nope. Still going to whistle. I just want to make a friend. Okay, prison yard. Let's go. Oh, sh oh, we're here. Oh. On the prison yard, your main task is to look for suspicious situations and act accordingly. Warning, direct force, disciplinary punishment. Pay attention to inappropriate behavior and other infractions like sneaking, fighting, suspicious discussions, destroying property, and urinating. I don't look like from different gangs. Look, he's from I Love Hamilton. He's from Tiny Testicles. Can we talk to these people? I want to look menacing. I want to, I want to rub it against the gate. That's it. Have your free time. We got a quest. Who we got here? Is this, is this who I think it is? Is this the man? Is this the man of the moment? Oh, it's not. <laughs> no, no, it's just it's a man that got the same skin. That's fine. You look quite okay. Maybe you want to earn some money. Um. Is that how you talk to all of the prison guards? <laughs> That's what you want. As I know, packages will come to the prison tomorrow, right? And you check what's inside. Is it possible you turn a blind eye to one of the packages? There'll be a syringe. Why is he so open about it? Like I wouldn't just beat him down and put him in solitary now. Hold up. <laughs> okay, uh, there's no free rides. Oh, you know what? Let's just, let's do his quest. Let's see, let's see how far we can take it. Yeah. Syringes, you want to shoot up. Oh, he paid me. $25. Okay. Alright, so they need to be out here for another 43 seconds. Is that a fight? I hear a fight. Ah! 
Aye. Aye. What the fuck is this guy doing? Making fires? What are you doing? Why are you trying to make fires? Dickhead. You'll be punished for this like, unacceptable behavior. I'm stuck. Oh. Someone's beating me. Um. You started a bloody fire. Now his mate wants to beat me up. Leave me alone. I'm getting, I'm getting battered. Right, him. Send this guy somewhere, please. You'll be punished. Uh, you are go. You're not leaving your cell. That's what you get for trying to jump me. Tiny testicles. You're in tiny testicles. He's not even in the same gang. I'm searching you, mate. You, you started a fire that I didn't put out. Someone else put it out for me. <laughs> Talk to the guard in the social room. Oh, and he's telling me I've got to get the syringes. All right. Who's this guy? He wants to play a game. Go make some money. Nothing illegal. Innocent basketball. Oh, you're. Hey, it's him. Are you murder? Oh, you are. You're M murder McTurda. Murder McTurda is a gambling man. Right. Does that mean yard time's over? How do I? How do I finish yard time? Right. I'm going to the social room, I guess. Can I not call it in? Have I not got a bell? How do I say time's up? Get back into your. Meh. I somehow gained respect by beating up two prisoners. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to complain, but I don't think that's how respect works. Unless they weren't cool cats. I did everyone else a favor. You want to chat, Alexander Davies? Hi, Richard told me I need to talk to you. Oh, really? That means you're ready to learn some new tricks. Do you teach anything other than beating prisoners more effectively? I'd be careful with such jokes, especially in the presence of prisoners. They are nothing more than they are nothing more than skills that will help you to survive in here. Which, by the way, should be very useful. Prisoners are twitchy. Try to solve conflicts by talking first. I can teach you, but you need two things. Skill points and money. So here's a skill tree. That's pretty cool. So I get to level up my warden. Come on. All right. Just give me your skills. So I can either have... Increase my health. Or prisoner cell searching is 25% faster. You have a higher chance of intimidating a prisoner into acting the way you want. That sounds a lot better. Just like that. If you ever have a C or something you shouldn't have, well, you're going to decide for yourself then. Just remember, there are ways to make friends and enemies in here. And you don't want to have enemies among your superiors, believe me. Yeah, I wonder what happens if you um get no respect from the prison guards. Like, what? Well, like, because they're not going to attack you, are they? Are you in a hurry? No. Play some darts? I don't know many variants of this game. Which one do you want to try? Uh, high score? Good choice. I'll tell you the rules in a minute. Maybe you would have a competitive spirit. How about a bet? Sure, $10. Let's go. Never played this? Let's do it. Simple game where the first player gets to a thousand points. What, I just aim and throw. Okay. How is that a miss? How is that a miss? That wasn't a miss. That guard hit the wall. He's just throwing them at walls. What the guy? What the this guy that keeps walking past. Stop it! You're going to get hurt! He's looking for a... Have you hurt yourself at workplace? I know your deal, buddy. Don't think I don't see your game plan. Alright, alright, whatever. I right. Let's pretend that I beat him. Let's pretend that I didn't just escape out of that because getting to a thousand is pretty long. 
Right, so we got our Mr. Power Up over here. So we did that. Let's pretend we took $10 off this chap over here. Get out of it. So what we've got to do, we've got to go to the parcel searching room. When checking Charles McKelly's package, leave the syringe in it. Okay, so that's that geezer that wanted syringes. Do we leave them or do we take them? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Okay, so let's try and work this out. So we've opened it up. So what we got? We got some Rufy's chocolate. Rufy's, all interesting choice of name there. Uh, open. Okay, that looks like chocolate to me. I might have a little nibble. A little nibble just to make sure it's not crack. Right, we've got chicken tits. Tasty chicken tits. Right, uh, how do we open? Right. I've got some... Just nothing but chicken tit. Right, that's fine. Manly scalp. Scalp purifying shampoo. Oh, wait, no, I'm not done with you yet. Hey. That's not supposed to be in there. Um. So do you say leave it? Or do I take it? Do I leave it? Oh, right. I see. This is illegal. It's worth $63. So I could I could uh, technically sell this to another uh, person that needs this bad boy. Or I could just be a, be a good little bootlicker and hand it in. I mean, I don't really want syringes getting passed around. I'm going to secure that. This is clearly that dude. Yeah, look, it. You're not even trying to hide it, man. Come on, you could have. Come on. If I. No, I'm. Su I'm. You're getting shut down, bro. I'm putting you in solitary when I see you next. Gave me $25, though. So, oi. Same with this nonsense. Right, what we got? Anti Zarephonix. Oh, not done with you. Oh, God. Right, he's going in the hold. Oh, jeez. How many does he need? What, to be fair, he's like, what, $200? He's making bank. The Boy with the Unicorn Tattoo by David Lesson. Cool, I think we're done here. E, please. We've got to do the others. Okay. Let's do the others. Forty-nine shades of any other colour. B. References. Woo. Okay, I suppose we've got any more needles. No, I don't think so. Is that meant? Is that powder supposed to be there? I hope so. Got some more chicken tits though. Yep, looks right. Oh God. More. Cool, this guy is going to be unhappy that I've taken all his needles. Oh, I better take that guy down to solitary confinement. Is he just standing out in the yard? I went to lock him away. Oh, we've got some drugs. I'll have one drug, please. That's also $63. God. Jeez, what's that? Just a brick. Securing that. I should have just taken it and started my own little drug empire. Damn it. This is like crypto all over again. Right. Shelf. Task complete. I was kicking off. I was kicking off. At least one of at least one responsible person in this shithole, some jerk lost prison keys. And not just one pair of them. Take a quick stroll around and find this shit as soon as you can before some prisoner finds it. Don't slack off. We don't have much time. Oh, what? So you're not going to help? No? Okay. Oh, shit. I'm timed. Uh, let's go here. This one's bare close. Super close in this room. Oh, they're just chilling. Just chilling. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Safety first and all that. We've only got um, rapists and murderers to deal with. Oh, not a moment to lose. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, there are people in here. Who's this? Charles Gordon. <laughs> Dickhead. Oh god, not enough stamina. Um 
Oh, this is a pair. In case of riot, do not lock in here. They are coming. Billy was here. Um. Hmm. Questionable. Why there was loads of blood and like no one's even attempted to clean it up. What's gone on in there? Why am I armed? In here? Ah. Aye. Aye, aye, aye. You're getting searched, mister. Good job, newbie. Thanks for that. Maybe next time look after your shit. You're talking to an officer. Watch your tone. Over and out. Hey, buddy, I want to talk to you. What do you want from me? Hey. No, I want to chat. Can I want to chat? Okay. Can we chat? Or just yawn in my face. That's fine, mate. The extra night shift kill will kill me. I hope so. Yawn in my face. God, that's my first day. Oh, God. Hi there, buddy. Um, Are you allowed to just work, like walk around shirtless in a workstation? Is that safety? Is that safety first? I don't think so. Mate, you're running a absolute loose ship here. And I don't want to be a part of it. So, so I'm going to hide in your locker. 